What is up YouTube? My name is Christian No, and uh, welcome to my first video. All right, so an update on the 240. Oh, let me get these towels off here. I don't want these towels on my car. Okay, so this is how the 240 looks right now. Here's the back. It's all one color, thank goodness. I, I bought it with a pretty decent body condition. It came much higher than this, but I, I had to lower it or slam it as much as I could on the coilovers it came with because it just looked gross at the monster truck it was at. I think these are XXRs that they came with. It has a Sylvia front end. I fucking love this Sylvia front end, man. It's so sick. I'll show you guys the interior a little bit. So it came with the Royal Grip steering wheel, a um, little uh, e-brake butt plug so I can rip that shit and get sideways. And here's my favorite part, these beauties, powered by Max, uh, comp coilovers, absolutely gorgeous product. I'm super stoked to install these. I got these at Custom Spring Rates and um, they were able to uh, get them um, revalved for me and everything. Thanks so much. PBM, appreciate it. And here are the angled toe arms. They look pretty sweet for the price. Boom. Looks like a pretty cool product. Um, they're really cheap, but since they're just traction rods, I'm just going to run for now and then make upgrades to PBMs later. Oops. Alright guys, so out with the old and in with the new. Alright, dude. So now I'm just going to make sure the preload is um, set at zero and uh, make sure the heights are even on the lower mounts. Again, this is a super clean product. It looks gorgeous, especially compared to these. These are some Tien's. <laughs> yeah, some Tien's. I think this one's actually bent <laughs> right here. It, it doesn't look like it's straight compared to this one right here. I don't know, fuck it. <laughs> I got these now. All right, guys, the front um, old TN coils are out. They look like shit. I'm glad they're out. And here are the PVM fronts. They look sick. This one's a 5 inch spring because I went with a custom rate. So I'm all about, I'm all about that low life. I want to have some style, style points while drifting so Let's do it. So I got the preload set. I actually just left the preload the way they sent it. It seemed like the collars are really tight, so I just left it. It's a really short spring, so I'm pretty sure I can get away without having any preload because it's going to be stiff as fuck already. Um, I set my heights already, so now it's time to put them in the car. Alright guys, got the coilover in in the rear. Got the toe arms in, right there, angled toe arm, and got the traction arm in. It looks absolutely gorgeous in here. Um, I would say if you're installing coilovers, uh, toe arms, and traction arms all in one, t all at one time, I would suggest taking the upper control arm bolt off here. Obviously, all these bolts here and these bolts while the coilover is off it is so much easier to slap all the arms on you can connect the bottom part of the coilover first and then use a jack and jack it all up while holding this holding the the coilover in place in position jack it up and you're set your money overall it was kind of a bitch doing it myself but dang this is a pretty dialed Rear end, I'm pretty stoked. Alright guys, so I got the front strut in. 
I am super stoked. They look fucking amazing in there. That bright gold. I absolutely love how um, the PBMs come with that um, machined in two, cam two degree and minus two degree camber here. The uh, top bolt is scooted in enough to give it two degrees without adjusting the top hat at all. I, on the other hand, maxed out the top hat as well because I'm trying to get that that uh, angle on my slides. So super stoked. The fronts were a breeze to install compared to the rears. Time to get some fitment in. The car is about done. We got, or I got everything installed. I'm super happy with how it turned out. All I have left to do really is just to um, roll this fender right here a little bit more. Um, I can barely fit a piece of paper in there, but I love the fit, man. It just needs a little bit of a rolling just to get a little bit of clearance. I'm running such stiff spring rates, so it won't even matter if I have, you know, barely enough clearance. And the front, I left a little bit more space up front for right now. But uh, in the near future, it's probably going to go lower. But until then, it's going to be like this for now. Uh, it turns out my wheels, uh, the, the weights that keep the wheel balanced fell off because of this heat in San Jose. It kind of sucks, so I got to go all the way back to Ace Tires and uh, get them rebalanced. Sam from Ace Tires is home. He's going to do it for free again because, you know, Yeah, I'm on my way to Ace Tires. The wheel's in the back. It's my little brother. Hey. Say what's up to what's my up? little brother. Say what's up to the YouTubers, Jeremy. Hey. All right. All right, what's up, guys? I just got the, just got the wheels balanced, rebalanced. So it feels good. Fucking the AC's on. It's 105 down here in San Jose today. Fuck, dude. It's kind of scary driving with rims in the back, especially on this back Subaru. Because, like, my wheels are bouncing everywhere and, like, not really hitting each other, but they're bouncing everywhere. It's kind of scary to me. But whatever. Fuck, dude. What's up, guys? I just pulled up to Christian's house. If you guys don't know who I am, I'm Randy Trung. I run the Eliminate channel. I'm Christian's homie, but uh, Christian's finishing up with the 240 right now. And if you guys are coming from the Eliminate channel here, you guys are the best. Thanks for coming over here. You're going to see a lot more videos. Christian's got the cleanest cars in the game. <laughs> you're so nice, homie. don't forget to hit the subscribe button. This will has taught me everything or most of the things I know about cars. So Christian's a cool dude. You guys, if he hasn't shown you yet, let me go show you his. WRX. Bam, this thing's a beauty. Look at this. Everything done by himself. This is my baby. I've had it for about three years. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram, go ahead and do that. Or head to our channel. If you guys are new and if you guys have never seen our video, go check that out too. Let's go, man. Stop it. Yo, I don't think you guys are ready for this, but Christian finished the 240 and that shit looks fucking sick as fuck. He's gonna he's gonna be pulling up right now. You guys didn't do a bad choice by choosing to watch this channel. Right, Kevin? Yep. Damn, I'm pretty jealous right now. Me too. I don't know why I got an S14 when I could have got an S13. Me too. Me too. Me too. Originally I wanted the S13 hatch. Fuck you, Christian. Fuck you. Damn. About to kill the, the game. Like About that. to kill the game. <laughs> hey, no one, no one's seen the S13 yet. What do you guys think? About the S13? Yeah. I haven't seen it yet. What the fuck? I haven't seen it yet. <laughs> seen it yet. He just drove in front I know, of me. I was just messing with you. <laughs> it's so boosted. It's pretty sick though. I kind of like it. It makes me want to go there. But so? it's lit. Holy crap! Who's whose WRX is this? This guy. It's got. It's got to be one of you guys. It's got to be one of you guys. Oh, it must be you. No, it's not. <laughs> Yo, after hearing Christians with that engine rumble like that, and hearing the pull off, I seriously want to go work on my engine now. Oh, damn! Oh, my Holy 
fuck? This fool's lips on the ground. Dude, this shit looks fucking sick. Yeah, it looks like a good muscle part. I like it. That shit's hella low. I like Christian's car. It's so fresh. I respect that. Look at that. This is that still his table. This is fresh as fuck. We're talking about C H R I. Wow. S T I A N Christian. I forgot how to spell it. This is what happens if you go check out his channel. Show this Christian. Dude, that front, that front pivot is front. Hey, this shit is fucking fresh. Straight beast in it. Damn, dude. I did okay, huh? Yeah, I did okay, huh? I did more than okay. Kevin kind of looked scared when he went with Randy. 